Welcome to the Yum Yum Yogi. Today we will be making Thai green curry. Because of the Yum Yum Yogi, we are all about having the right consciousness while cooking. Let's reflect on this thought while making this green curry. I am loving because I nurture the longing for truth that lives in the heart of every soul. For this recipe, we need what seem like a lot of ingredients. But they're not that bad. Once you gather them all together, we need half a cup fresh coriander stems and leaves, four to six kaffir lime leaves. You get these in the Oriental store. 10 Thai green chilies or to taste. You can even use one if you want. One tablespoon galangal powder. And two tablespoons lemongrass powder. One teaspoon ginger paste. one teaspoon ground coriander, half a teaspoon salt, half a teaspoon ground cumin, one third cup coconut milk, one teaspoon palm sugar. Now let's gather these ingredients into a blender jar. There goes the salt, the ginger paste, the cumin powder, the coriander powder, cilantro leaves and stems, kefir lime leaves, the chilies, the galangal powder and the lemongrass powder. Now add the coconut milk. We need about half a cup of fresh basil leaves for the curry paste, but the basil leaves have to be blanched. Just blanch them in boiling water for about 20 seconds, not too long, just 20 seconds. And add these leaves to the blender jar and pulse till a fine paste is formed. There, nice and green looking curry paste. For this recipe, I'm going to use carrots and other vegetables. You can use whatever vegetables you want. I'm using carrots, one and a half cups of green beans, one red bell pepper, and eight Asian eggplants. These Asian eggplants are usually used in green curry. So I'm taking eight of these and store them in salt water till you're ready to use them in the curry. I'm also going to add six ounces of extra firm tofu for protein. One 14 ounce can coconut milk. Do not shake the milk and it has to be a full fat coconut milk because we need the cream on top. We don't use oil. We take a heavy bottom saucepan, put it on medium high heat and take about two tablespoons of cream of coconut milk and one fourth of a cup Thai green curry paste and saute the paste in the coconut milk for about a minute. Now we start adding the vegetables First, the green beans go in. The red bell pepper. The carrots and the tofu. Take the Asian eggplants out of the water the salt water and add them in. And saute for about a minute all of these vegetables on high flame. Add rest of the can of coconut milk, two cups of water, a 
Cover, reduce the flame and let simmer for about five to seven minutes till the vegetables are just about done. Don't let them get overcooked. Add one teaspoon miso paste and two teaspoons mirin. Blend very well and add to the cooking curry. At this point, you can add about one tablespoon palm sugar. Switch off the heat. So now if the vegetables are done, switch off the heat. Add salt to taste. And juice of one lime. Serve with rice. I'm using black rice here. Doesn't it look delicious? This is such a delicious Thai green curry. But before we eat it, let's reflect on this thought I am loving because I nurture the longing for truth that lives in the heart of every soul.